this is Simatron E10 uh, mode code exercise. So before you start this exercise, make sure you copy this CTF file into your working folder. You can right click, select save target as, save it into your working folder. Okay, after that, uh, go to file, unpack. We unpack this file. And then press control button on the keyboard and A to select all and then click unpack. Uh, this we change to without folder history and select the file your working folder to save the unpack file and then select OK and then we load the file load it from your working folder after that we go to here we select the more code okay at the more code here, we have uh, two options. The first one is calculate data and save. And the second one is uh, more code generator. And the first option is mandatory to select it first before you uh, export to the more code. Yeah. So we click it and then select yes. And then we go to the more code again. This time we select the second options, more code generator. Okay, this is the this is the more code generator, and this one is load data from Simatron E. And at here is the more data area, and this is the plate table, and this one is the part table. Okay, now you can see here. The more data here is empty, the area here is empty and then so what we need to do is click this update more data uh, button. So you can see here the more data uh, is update. Yeah. After that, we go to here, the play table here, and the task name, we select uh, the um, mode design, and this, we select the plate. Yeah, if you didn't have uh, this, the name, the task name, and the expand types, um, you can go to here, reference table management and select here uh, the expand types from here and you can add in yeah and um, you if you want to add in you just click new and then uh, add add here we have the uh, group options a group here have three options sorry uh, the first is the label then the second one is materials and the third one is other and uh, price by we can select area volume fixed price weight unit and others okay and the task also same you can select from here and at here we can uh, select uh, the part level the mode level and the active if you don't want the active you uncheck it okay and then okay this one we select the mode design and this is plate after that we select this create selected plate so you can see here the information is come up at here after that uh, we all the data, uh, plate table data here we change to mode design and uh, plate okay after then uh, uh, change the task name and then we check all after that click this one create selected plates okay now you can see here the the data all at here, the more expenses, yeah. Okay, next we select this row and then this cover 17 work. 
yeah and then you click this edit and update part and after that click ok accept default yeah so you can see here the parts have the cover 17 work already and then we can close the load data from Simatron E yeah Okay, this is the more code generator uh, window and this is the toolbar. Yeah, and here this is to create a new blank code. This is open existing code. This is save. This is save as. This is the code, code setting. Yeah, you can select the part image, uh, more image size, the configuration image size. Yeah, and then you can uh, change the unit system. Okay, and the date and the de delivery info and everything. Yeah, and this is the reference table management. And at here we have uh, expand types tasks, expand groups, customers yeah, you can save the customers uh, information at here, oh sorry ok and this is the part material yeah, we can select the material, we can also save the material at here and this is the two material yeah Okay, and then it have the density and active or not. This is the status. So it has the draft, approve or submitted or accept or reject. Yeah, and this is the category. It is category as the more order or design or ECO or production. And the units. Yeah, you can ins uh, add in the units. Yeah, for now uh, only three inch mm and mm to niche. Okay, this is the generate code report. Later I will show you. Okay, this is how it looks. And this is the more code help content the tutorial and about the more coding okay the second one here the job details and uh, more uh, more data so uh, this is about the code names yeah it's automatically and the customer we can this create a new customer or edit the customer and then we can select uh, key in the customer job number and the status just now I told you already draft approve submitted accept or reject yeah category is uh, it has more order design ECO or production and the material we can select from here and you also can key in by yourself and then mark up how many percent and the code information and the comment also can key at here and this is the more data more data uh, we can key in the name the length the width the height the oh sorry uh this one you will not need to key in just now because we are a lot from here yeah we update the more data so everything, every the uh, everything of the data here, the data of the uh, assembly, or after we click this update more data, it will uh, display at here. Yeah. So and we also can uh, key in the number of slider, lifter, insert, ejector, electrodes, and also we can check or uncheck the hot runners if you have used okay and um, this one is uh, the part or more expand area 
so just now I uh, show you already and at here is the picture display area we can load the image or you attach the image yeah it's same it's this is formal and this is for configurations okay and here is the total cost area and if, uh, at the total cost area here have uh, two options the first one is by expense the second one is by group yeah so you can see and at here we have the um, subtotal price discount tax grand total price yeah and here also have and this is the add new row uh, icon this is the delete row icon this is move the row up or down icon and this is um, edit this is add new rows okay and this is view chart yeah and this is the actual cost 